ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ್ಯಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂಧು ವೈವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ವೃಂದಾವೈತುಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈಕೇಶವ ಸಕ್ತಿಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ವಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರು ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ಭವಿಷ್ಠದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಸರಣ್ಯ ಪೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪುನುತಪಾಲಭವಾಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣಾರ್ಭಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗಪವಧೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶಿ ಪುರುನಾನುರಾಗ್ರಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾ ಕೃಪಾಂಕರೋಸ್ತು ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶಿವಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶಿವಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೋ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲ ಹ್ಯುತಾಕ್ಷೋ ವಿಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭಾರೋ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿತ್ತ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀ ತಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ಭಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀತ್ ಚಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
गौरांगकगतिर भजा शीतमती श्री गौरधाम स्थिति सहसाशक कुसंग विरती दुस्त व्यथा निष्कृति श्री रूपकती सनातन नती श्रीजीवते जोस्ति श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठीपति गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगह प्रभुपाद जगत गुरु टोल्ड वी आर गोइंग टू वी आर गोइंग टू लिव दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड वेरी शॉर्टली गौरिया गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद जगत गुरु टोल्ड वी आर गोइंग टू लिव दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड वेरी शॉर्टली सो विद इन दिस शॉर्ट टाइम वी मस्ट जॉइंटली we must jointly serve radha govind gaur hari we must preach the message of rup raghunath jointly there should be coordination cooperation should be properly there and under the guidance of same ashray vigraha under the guidance of same under the guidance of same ashray vigraha we should serve radha govind gaur hari seva we should do we should preach the message of Ra we should preach the message of gaur we should preach the message of rup sanatan rup raghunath actually actually the message of rup raghunath means actually the message of rup raghunath means the message of gaurang mahaprabhu message of ruk rohunath means the message of gaurang mahaprabhu so under the guidance of same guru pad padma matlab <coughs> same ashray tatva vigraha we must do our bhajan actually godadhar pandit goswami is guru tatva gadadhar pandit goswami simati radharani gadadhar pandit goswami is radharani non different from radharani actually bhakti vinod thakur speaking <coughs> sila sachidanand bhakti vinod thakur pihi Sila Sachidanda Bhakti Mohan Thakur speaking. Then in Archan Marg, that in Archan Marg, we should worship. Actually, in Archan Marg, we should worship Gaur Vishnu Priya. In Archan Marg, we should worship Gaur Vishnu Priya, and in Bajan Marg. raganuga mark we must worship gaur gadadhar vigraha in archan mark we must worship gaur vishnu priya and in bhajan mark raganuga mark <coughs> we must worship gaur gadadhar vigraha gadadhar pandit goswami non different from radharani but we hear from shastra that gauranga mahaprabhu and radharani non different we hear gauranga mahaprabhu is radharani how actually gauranga mahaprabhu is vishay vigraha bhagwan sri krishna coming in the form of gauranga vigraha and taking all baba and complexion golden complexion of radharani if the baba of radharani is stolen 
if the bhava of radharani is stolen by Gaur <coughs> if the bhava of radharani is stolen by goranga mahaprabhu and golden complexion of body that's why we say that goranga mahaprabhu with radha bhava then when bhava is stolen if bhava is stolen by bhagwan sri krishna Gorang Mahaprabhu already coming. And then there is effulgence, money, actually Tej. It is called Tej. Radharani Tej. Tej means actually effulgence. Taking the form of Gadadhar Das. Gadadhar Das Goswami, there in Arya Daha, in Calcutta. There is a sipad of Gadadhar Goswami. There is a sipad of Gadadhar Goswami. It is actually the body effulgence of Radharani. And Bhava stolen and Radharani coming in the form of Gadadhar Pandit. Radharani coming in the form of Gadadhar Pandit. Actually, Gadadhar Pandit. is the son of Madhav Mishra and mother is Ratnavati. All Gauranga Mahaprabhu and most of his parsad, <coughs> Gauranga Mahaprabhu and most of his parsad, they all, most of them take birth, Adyaita Gosai and everybody, they take birth in Silet, Sri Hatto. It's called Srihatto, Silet. They all took birth almost in Silet. And Godadhar Pandit from very childhood, from very childhood, actually, Madhav Vishnu watching, from very childhood, the boy is always doing bhakti. All his education, everything done there, after that, Madhav Mishra, Ratnamati Devi, they all gone from this material world. Godadhar Pandit coming here and is <coughs> Goranga Mahapu staying in Jokpit, what do you know? The house of Sachi Mata Jagannath Mishra. And their house is just near. Their house is just near. Godadhar Pandit house. Is just near, <coughs> just near our Goranga Mahapu's house. From very childhood, that Godadhar Pandit was always playing with Adwaita Gosai. Always playing with Goranga Mahaprabhu. From very childhood, Adwaita Gosai is playing with Goranga Mahaprabhu. And when when Growing up, gradually when Mahaprabhu wanted to express his own mood, Sankirtan, Jagya, then Gautadhar Pandit, you know, expressing total seva. Actually, in childhood there was different kind of playing and everything. But when gradually growing up, Vishwanath Chakotipad writing that Gaur Godadhar Lila, Ashtokalin Lila. Gaur Godadhar, Ashtokalin Lila, if we can concentrate side by side, those who are actually elevated devotees, those who are actually elevated devotees, if they are going to concentrate in Radha Govinda Ashtokalin Lila, Vishwanath Chakoti was speaking, they must concentrate in Gaur Godadhar Lila first. Ashtokalin Lila of Gauranga Mahaprabhu with Godadhar Pandit, they must remember, they must inside, not for ordinary devotees, for elevated devotees. They can concentrate in this kind of Lila, then it is complete. If they are going to ignore Gauranga Mahaprabhu Ashtokalin Lila, then there can be some problem, they can fall down. Because Gaur Lila is the complete explanation of Radha Govinda Lila. 
Gauranga Lila is the complete explanation of Radha Govinda Lila. That's why Vishwanath Chakut was speaking. Astukalin Lila of Gauranga Mapu, you should remember first. After that, side by side, all the same, you can see. Here in Jokpit Mandir, from the very morning time, in Vrindavan also, Nishanto Lila, night time Lila over. When morning time, Lolita Sukhi doing Arati, before that, Nishanto Lila, after that, Lolita Sukhi doing Arati. Here also you can, Naro Hari Adi Kori, Chamaro Rulai, you know the Kirtan. This way, in Jogopit Simandir also, Jogopit Matlab, Jogopit Matlab we know, assembly. All Gauranga Mahaprabhu in different time in Ostokan in Lila, going here and there. But sometime in Vrindavan, sometime in Vrindavan, sometime in Vrindavan, all devotees they get together. They are doing different seva together. That is called Jokpit. Here also, all devotees doing different kind of seva, different time. But that time, most of the devotees, they get together, they are doing different kind of seva. That is called Jogopi. Jogopi means they assembly. Together, this kind of seva, they are going on here in Jogopi, Sri Mandir. Godadar Pandit playing with Gauranga Mahapu here and there. And Sanand Bhakti Muttagu writing in Kirtan. Godadar in left hand side, taking Godadar in left hand side, Gauranga Mahapu there. Our Aroti is set up going on Sananda Sukhada Kunje, Godadhari Brahme Kori, Godadhar in left side. This kind, this kind of Leela actually going on. Godadhar Pandit having full detachment from, from the beginning. Godadhar Pandit actually total detachment. Total detachment, Godadar Pandit showing total detachment. Godadar Pandit showing total detachment just from the beginning, from very beginning. Godadar Pandit don't like to do material sanction, nothing. So always like shadow, staying with Goranga Mahaprabhu. When Goranga Mahaprabhu coming back from Gaya Dham, when Gauranga Mahaprabhu coming back from Goyadham and just going to express his, you know, express his mood, Sankirtan Yogya mood and Rad, gradually going to express Baba. In that case, in Siva Sangan, Sankirtan Yogya going on, Gauranga Mahaprabhu day by day, Losing patience in a day, in whole day, sometime Gorang Mahapu expressing different kind of strong feeling of separation. Sochi Mata cannot control Gorang Mahapu anymore. Big problem. Sochi Mata cannot control Gorang Mahapu. Whole day, what happening? Who knows? Sometime crying, sometime, you know. Shouting, dancing, what happened? One day Godadar Pandit was there in the house of you know Jagannath Misro and Gauranga Mahapu crying and asking, Gadadhar, you ask me where where I can where is Krishna? Where is Krishna? You just speak me, speak out. Godadar Pandit speaking, Godadar Pandit speaking, Krishna is there inside your heart. Then Gauranga Mahapu with the nail going to tear all chest and blood coming. Godadar immediately arrest in her hand and try to check, somehow going to give some consolation. Sochima speaking, Godadar, if today if you are not there, I was going to die. Because who can check him? Just Godadar speak, Krishna is there inside your heart, then going to tear heart. Blood coming out. This way, Swachima giving instruction to Gadadhar Pandit that all the time you should stay with 
Gauranga, like shadow. All the time, like shadow, you should stay with Gauranga, don't even fraction of a second. That's why it is eternal relationship. Eternal relationship, no? It, the eternal relationship, you know? So, this way, Gadadhar Pandit, like shadow, staying with, you know, Gauranga. One day, Gauranga Mahaprabhu crying in the name of, in the name of Pundarik Vidyanidhi. Pundarik, Bap, my father, crying. Nobody knows who is Pundarik Vidyanidhi. Because Pundarik Vidyanidhi is not coming here in Gaurdham as yet. Is there in Sri Hatta. Nobody knows who is Pundarik Vidyanidhi. Then Godadhar and other devotees, they are asking Mukundo, who is Pundarik? But within very, within a, within a few days, within a few days, you can, within a few days, you can see who is Pundarik Vidyanidhi. He is coming shortly. My heart is, you know, always thinking about him. He is a great devotee. Then in the meantime, Gada, in the meantime, Pundarik Vidyanidhi coming. And Mukundo, I already told Mukundo, Sivas Pandit, Adhita Gosai, most of them, they are from Sri Hatta. Sri Hatta, one place, northern part of at present Bangladesh. At present Bangladesh is northern part. There they took a very holy place. Sochi Mata, Jagannath Misro. Oh, who not? Our, you know, father of Sachi Mata, they all took birth, most of them took birth there in Sri Hatta. So holy place. So holy place, we cannot, you know. So from there, they are actually eternal relationship with Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Said so they are supposed to come automatically, like magnet. Gauranga Mahaprabhu, before coming, before appearing Gauranga Mahaprabhu, before appearing Gauranga Mahaprabhu sent some of his paraphernalia. And after taking birth, some paraphernalia, like Northum Thaku, Sinibhata, they are all coming. This is a system. Bhagavan, before coming, sending some for Leela, nourishment of total Leela. And after gone, some devotee is coming or going to disappear at the at that time all devotees they are coming for the nursement of Gauranga Lila, full nursement of Gauranga Lila. So Pundari Vidyanidhi coming here in Gaurdham and our Gauranga Mahapu speaking is a great devotee. Very shortly you can realize Mukundo is the eternal person of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Mukundo one day speaking, Mukundo one day speaking, you, Gadadhar Pandit, Mukundo one day speaking to Gadadhar Pandit, I can take you to meet, I can take you to meet with that great devotee. I can take you to meet that great devotee. You can come with me. Really so? Then Gadadhar Pandit going with and you know going with Mukundo to take darshan of that great devotee. Mukundo, it is one kind of Lila. Actually, Pundarik Vidyanidhi is Vishwanu, Vishwanu Raja is a is a Vishwanu Raja and Gadadhar Pandit Vishwanu Nandini. Baba stolen, okay. Some, separate, some little separate Baba coming. Actually, Godadhar Baba is positive Baba. Radhanani Baba is not positive. Radhanani Baba is always negative Baba. Negative means always Bhamma Bhav. Bhamma actually translation not possible. So I speak this way. Don't think negative means bad. Negative means always become, you know, some, some angry attitude become, you know, this way. Bhamma Bhav. Bhamma Bhav always, you know, some exchange of, 
you know, Baba, with Gorang, with uh, Prabhu. So Gadadhar Pandit actually, I can explain it after. Gadadhar Pandit now going to meet Vishwanu Maharaj, and he is Vishwanu Nandini. But this kind of Leela I am manifesting. They are when going to take darshan. Gadadhar Pandit watching, he is like king. He is sitting in a bed, so costly. Bedstead is so costly, like a king taking rest. And a pillow is there, very soft pillow, there. And here is all back brass with very nice scented oil in a back brass. And there is very chain, very golden chain, everything. And taking rest in a pillow and chewing, chewing bitter lip. Chewing bitter lip and sometimes spitting on a very golden, you know, pot. Chewing pan, pan money, bitter leaf. Godadar Pundya, and there is one, there is one, uh, you know, like umbrella, like umbrella, there is one, you know, there is one, like umbrella, there is one, cloth, very costly, up. Like pandal, you know, pandal, you know, like there is very costly, very nice decoration, up, very nice. Godadhar Pandit now thinking, I was think I was I was hearing about I was here I was here I was hearing about uh, Pundarik Bindani. It was good. Now I come I come in front of Pundarik Bindani. It is very dangerous for me because I cannot believe how a devotee can be like this. A devotee with full aristocracy, how possible? Because devotee usually in his kinchan, they, uh, at all there is money, they are like Prahlad Maharaj, or they are they are detachment. He is full like, you know, bogey, you know, enjoyer, sense enjoyer. This kind of Baba came inside the heart of Gadadhar Pandit, it is one kind of Leela. Gadadhar Pandit is not foolish, it is one kind of Leela. To show you, to show you some you know, Siddhanta Vichar. In the meantime, Mukundo watching the face of Gadadhar Pandit, Gadadhar, he could realize by watching this kind of aristocracy, Gadadhar is going to develop some negative mood, not good. So how to save him? Because already Vaishnava Prat, if I, if I misunderstand one Vaishnava, if I misunderstand one Vaishnava, Prabhupada used to say, that Vaishnava Sangha is the topmost way. Vaishnava Sangha is the topmost way to get benefit in Bhajan. And Vaishnava Sangha is yet, still, Vaishnava Sangha is uh, so dangerous. If you make mistake, so easily you can go to hell. To go to hell, the easiest way is to make aparadha unto the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava. And the easiest way to go to eternal world is Sadhu Sangha. Both. If you misunderstand, then big problem. So to save Gadadhar Pandit, Mukundo started singing one sloka. Gadadhar, Gadadhar Pandit standing here and Mukundo started speaking one sloka from Srimad Bhagavatam. Barha piram natavarabapu karnayo karnikaram Vidyadavazakanako kopisam bhaiyayan tinchyamalam Randhana bhena radara sudaya Pura yana gopa brindvai Vrindarannam sapadaramanam Pravishad gita kirti This sloka mukunda purposely They are eternal parsat of Bhagavan, they understand. When Mahaprabhu's bhav is in a radha bhav, then to give some nourishment of the Leela, consolation, then Raya Ramananda speaking accordingly, according to the bhav of Gauranga Mahapu inside Gambira, and our Sarup is singing accordingly, and our Mukunda also. There are so many cases. You can go to Chaitanya Bhagavad, Chaitanya Charitamrita, so many times. According to the Baba of Gauranga they could they can realize 
immediately and start doing kirtan and they start doing kirtan supporting the Baba of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. This is the Leela. For this reason they are coming together, nourishment of God. Anyway, whenever Mukunda is going to sing this song, whenever, when Mukunda is going to sing this song, immediately, immediately our Pundarik Vidyandi, he was this way, you know, sleeping in the bed and with pillow there supporting very nice background. Immediately when you speak the slok and the dress, you know, very nice silk, very costly silk, you know, shirt, everything, dhoti, very costly. Immediately and there is button, button, you know, button, very costly, golden button like, you know, son in law, jamai. Immediately when the slok was spoken, that immediately our Pundarik Vidyandi going to throw everything and going to tear the chest. All head, he fall down from the bedstead and is crying heavily. Where is Krishna? Where is Krishna? In separation, very heavily. Nobody can check him. So heavy Baba appear. All, you know, in the golden pot where he is going to spit. After chewing the all gone here and there, all ornament, all everything, everything gone. Going to tear the cloth, going to tear the heart, where is Krishna? Then, then Gadadhar Pandit was surprised. Oh my God! Oh my God! One pure devotee cannot be known so easily. You cannot pass any remark about any pure devotee. Like our Siddhar Maharaj. I have a Siddhar Maharaj. If you look at Siddhar Maharaj, you, cannot, you can misunderstand sometimes. Full overcoat, you know, overcoat, full overcoat, like, you know, foreign people. Like overcoat, very nice dress, and at, 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 when Maharaj was, you know, aged enough, that time there was some burning in the body. So, doctor told to make some AC, little AC, normal condition. So that Maharaj, so all the time, follow. If you stay with Siddhar Goswami, you can misunderstand him. You cannot understand. Every step. But those who are elevated devotee, like Sila, Bhakti Pumat Puri Goswami Maharaj, Jajavar Goswami, they know how, what a great devotee he is. Follow. This way, Gadadhar Pandit was surprised to see the mood. Oh my God, I have done some big aparad unto our Lord's feet. What to do? Now, what to do? He is consulting Gadadhar Pandit, now was in tension, what to do? And after that, <coughs> he took decision and speaking to Goranga Mahaprabhu that I have done some mistake. So to rectify myself, I think I should take shelter of Pundarik Vidyanidhi. I can take Diksha from him so that Guru always going to give show mercy to disciple. When going to take shelter, I submit unto Lotus Feet, the automatically I have done some mistake, okay. I have done some mistake, okay, but now if I, uh, you know, submit on the lotus feet of Gurudev 100% and pray for, beg for mercy, Gurudev can show mercy and give mantra. <coughs> this way, Gadadhar Pandit ultimately took shelter of Srila Pundarik, <coughs> Pundarik Vidyanidhi. He took shelter of Pundarik Vidyanidhi. So, this way, Gorang Mahaprabhu gradually going to express different bhava, which is going to indicate that surely Mahaprabhu cannot stay in this form. Mahaprabhu is going to leave us. Finally, it was true. Gorang Mahaprabhu leaving this Gaurdham, eternal lila going here. 
Now going to take sannyas. After taking sannyas, Gorang Mahapu going to Nilachal Dham. Gadadhar Pandit also, I am going to cut short because there are so many lila. Education lila, because Gorang Mahapu, Gorang Mahapu used to read Gangadas Pandit, you know, he used to read there. And our Gadadhar Pandit also used to read there. Mane, they together, you know, they together used to, you know, study, they together used to do. So, Gaurang Mahapo used to play with him sometime. Gaurang Mahapo sometime ask, asking question. So, you are uh, reading logic, nay. So, you speak, give answer, how you can give. This way, some question answer going on. Gorang Mapu usually going to defeat Godadar. Defeat Godadar going to give some argument. This way some fighting going on, sweet fighting. And when Gorang Mapu going to play, you know, Lila in Godrum Deep here, there, different garden like Mango Lila, you know, Amgata, you know, Amgata. While going to Nishingapalli, you can get one place where, where all mango trees, you know, have seen. Not seen. Harihar Khetro, this way, there you can say all were mango trees. There Gorang Mapu, it is called Amghata. Gorang Mapu was doing big festival of mango. Mango festival. Amro Utsap. In Chaitanya Bhav Chaitanya, Gorang Mapu, one sheet of mango putting in in the land, in the ground, immediately is going sprout, and immediately the tree becomes very big. And going to show, uh, you know, mango, everything full of mango. One mango, this is size. That Goranga Mapu requests devotees to go and get mango. I can do utsap, a mango utsap. First offering to Krishna and giving to all devotees that mango utsap, everything. Godadar was there. So many. I'm going to cut short. So many gold lila here. In Damparikram, I was speaking in Hindi, so many Leela here and there in total Gaurdham used to do this kind of Leela. And the younger brother of Gadadhar Pandit is Baninath. Baninath, you know? Baninath, you know, Chap Chapahati, you know, Baninath? Baninath is the younger brother of Gadadhar Pandit. There is Gaur Gadadhar Vigraha. There is Gaur Gadadhar Vigraha, you know, Chapahati. There, Maninath used to install this seva. And still today, under the guidance of Prabhupada, this seva going on there. So, Maninath doing seva there, and Gadadhar Pandit always staying with him. So, Gauranga Mahaprabhu doing different kind of lila here in Gaur Gaurdham. That, that time, Godadhar was also there with him all the time. And specially, night time Leela, night time Leela, there was flower, very nice flower bed. There Gauranga Mahapu sleeping, Godadhar left side. But there should not be any wrong conception. Why I started with Pohupad? Because Pohupad is our starting and Pohupad is our end point. Pohupad repeatedly giving warning to us. Pohupad always giving warning to us that there should not be any wrong conception, material conception. If you have any material conception, you can fall down. Someday I can discuss about Balaram Ras. How wrong conception is there with people. You know, they speaking, Balaram doing Ras with you know, with the group of Krishna. But even if they are writing the name of Prabhupada. They are speaking, Prabhupada wrote commentary in Chaitanya Bhagavad. We search nowhere Prabhupada speaking like this. But they are speaking wrong Siddhanta in the name, in the name of Prabhupada. In the name of Prabhupada they are writing all wrong Siddhanta. No Acharya can give answer. If I give answer, they can make me target. No, nobody can give answer. 
One article I signed was totally wrong Siddhanta. They are speaking, mistake. They are, they are personal Siddhanta. They are giving attributes in the name of Prabhupada. So Prabhupada is our starting. Bhakti Vinatakur Prabhupada is our starting. And end point is our Prabhupada. All beginning to end, all Prabhupada. Prabhupada giving warning. Gaur Gadathar Lila and Gaur Vishnu Priya Lila. Vishnu Priya Day, you can remember I was speaking. There should not be any wrong conception. There is no enjoying mood. There is no enjoying mood between Gauranga and Vishnu Priya. If you misunderstand, you can die. You can fall down. It is just like Lakshmi Narayan. The conception of Lakshmi eternally present, Lakshmi Narayan. Is the conception. And the conception of Gaur Gadadhar is just like Radha Govindu. But conception is Radha Govindu, it's okay. But there should not be any Shambhog directly. Follow. Gadadhar is sleeping here, Gorangamapu is sleeping, flower, red, all to show us what is the secrecy. All to show us what is the secrecy, Gaur Shakti Gadadhar to show us the secrecy of the Leela. And after that, it is written, when you grow up, if you can get maturity, I can myself can explain very secretly. I can explain that Gaurang Mahapu now in the Nishanto Leela gone, morning time, that quail, you know, quail, coo, coo, you know, you know shouting, then Gaurang Mahapu break, you know, Vishwanath Chakotri are writing one very nice book, but we have no right to read right now. Though I feel sigh that I already read that book. I should not have, I should not read that book. But without me, I read that book. But there are fine, very nice mood. That Shapno Bilasamritam. Shapno Bilasamritam in dream. In dream. You know, that Gaur Gadadhar Lila and Radha Govinda Lila, Gaurang Mahapu, Golden Compassion, Krishna taking, all this kind of very nice, you know, Baba there. So, in the morning time, in Jogopit, there, Gaurang Mahapu get up right from the beginning. Those who are following Ashtakalin Lila, I don't know how they are following. Because there is strict restriction by Sila Bhaktivinoda Thakur, Prabhupada, everybody, Ashtakal in Lila. Ordinary people, they have no right to. Anyway, some of them following, uh, and there it is written, Kittana Prabhabe Smarana Haive. Srila Bharti Maharaj also used to explain this way, I also explain. When automatically Kirtan going on inside your heart, when automatically, when you are walking, eating, sleeping, Kirtan going on inside your heart, when Kirtan automatically going inside your heart, in that case, all, you know, a series of thoughts can come, automatically, or prakita, or prakita, all, you can see like, you know, scenery, like scenery inside your heart appear, one by one. I am not speaking story. Don't think everyone speak, picked it a story, not that. When you can reach up to that stage, then a series of thoughts can come. You can see like scenery, like scenery, direct you can see. Goranga Lila, all everything, right from the beginning. 3.30, 4 o'clock, you know. Quell and shouting. Then after that, Gauranga Mahapu get up. Gadadhar get up. They are doing different kind of lila there. Aruti, everything. In the morning, Aruti, you know. Vale Gora Gadadharir. Aruti Nehari. Nodiya Purava Bhave Javali Hari. This Kirtan. This Kirtan is a complete, you know, you know remembrance of the Ashtokalin first Leela, morning time. We have no right 
because we can misunderstand. That's why Siddhar Goswami Maharaj purposely, you know, write another kirtan for ordinary people. Under the guidance of Bhakti Muttakur. Somebody is speaking, Bhakti Muttakur writing this kirtan, why Keshav Maharaj writing this? This is wrong Siddhanta, don't speak that way. If you speak this way, you can do opera. Under the guidance of Bhakti Muttakur, with, with a mood of, with a mood of apology, with a mood of apology, our Keshav Goswami are writing one kirtan, morning kirtan. Because there in kirtan completely it is written, openly it is written. Completely it is written, Bindavane Kalpataru Briksha, that is Sri Kalpataru, there are Radha Govindo, all Shakhi Manjuri around. Now common people, those who are with sense enjoyer, they can follow what is Vale Gora Gadadhare Aroti Nehari Nadi Apurabo Bhabe Jao Boli Hari Kalpataru Tale Ratno Shingasano Pori Shabosoki Bestito Kishoro Kishori and common people can say what they are doing, all young girls and Krishna, he, they can misunderstand. They are sense in your, na? Those who are sense in your, those who are sense in your, each and every day, each and every step they misunderstand. What they are doing, morning time, night over, what they are doing, Shish. they can misunderstand. Like South Indian people. They, they think it is more practical to worship uh, Lakshmi Narayan. It's not authentic. They are thinking this way, writing this way. Uh, they are writing this way, uh, they are thinking this way, Pope are speaking. That's why for common people prohibited, those who are elevated devotees, they, are, they can remember this kind of Gauranga Astakalin Lila, if your material karma, Gone already, you can discuss and you can see Gauranga get up, how Gauranga Mahaprabhu get up after that, you know, going to take bath in Ganga, when, how, all different Leela, day to day when, doing what Leela, all, everything, Vishwanath Chakrati writing in series. In series here is writing, but you should tally the mood. In the morning time, when Gauranga Mahapu getting up in this way, that time, same, where Gauranga Mahapu is showing here, same Leela there in Radha Govinda. Radha Govinda, same, when Krishna breaking, you know, is, you know, sleep, how, same mood. Gauranga Mahapu showing same mood with that, with Godadha. This way, but people can misunderstand so, Ordinary for no, this is not open for ordinary people. First of all, Nam Bhajan should appear. All your Nam. If you can get taste in Harinam, if you can get taste in Panchadatta and Harinam, then you are going to get green signal. Harinam is itself complete. If you have strong belief in Harinam, 100% belief, then Bhakti Mataka speaking, Harinam can give you everything. Follow. Harinam can give you everything. If you have strong belief. When Prabhupada was given Harinam, Bhakti Muttakur not doing any mistake. I can give one example, but you cannot imitate. You cannot imitate. When Bhakti Muttakur giving Harinam to the small boy Bhimala Prasad and giving instruction him to worship, to worship Kurma Vigra. Follow. Follow what I mean to say. Bhakti Thakur giving only Harinam. Bhakti Thakur only giving Harinam to Bhimala Prasad. And how Bhakti Thakur giving instruction to Bhimala Prasad to worship Kurmadev, Kurmadev means Salogram. Confusion. But Bhakti Thakur not make any mistake. Bhakti Thakur giving instruction to Bhimala Prasad, not to you and me. Because Bhakti Muttakur know 
Bhakti Muto knows it very well that Bhimala Prasad is the eternal Prasad of Gauranga. Bhakti Muto knows it very well. And this Harinam, 100%. Harinam means initiation. What do you mean by initiation? Sometimes you are crying, writing letter to me. But I am feeling pain. But actually, if you can hear Harikatha, I mean, Vyasa Sahib, hear Harikatha perfectly. Through Harikatha, you can develop a sense of Samanda. It's called Diksha, like Parikhid Maharaj. But usually in Kalika, I cannot suggest this way, that people can say, Maharaj speaking this way, they can start argument. But this is fact. Through Harikatha, if you can develop a, a Samanda again, and you are every day hearing Harik, Harinam, Every day hearing, na? almost every day hearing Harinam. We hear the Harinam of Guru Maharaj. Guru Maharaj, I make. I never make any recording of Guru Maharaj Harikatha by Harinam, by the instruction of Vaishnava. I make Kuri 20 minutes Harinam and that we make and repeatedly, we make total whole day recurring. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. It's going on. And Kirtan. Gauranga bolite habe pula ko shori ro Gauranga mahap. Guru Maharaj si. Very old age, very old age, very. 98, 8, 99 that. So, this kind of transcendental vibration. Of course, for Dikha, remote control is not possible. Remote control only possible when you are 100% submission and taking Harinam Dikha from directly. Harinam Dikya over telephone is not possible. Directly. Otherwise, all be, whole world becomes Sahajiya. It's not. So, you have right your, if, you, if your heart is, you know, clean, then you can get opportunity to serve deity. Why not? And those who are taking Dikya for 20 years, they are not going to clean their heart. How they can get how they can get right for archan follower. Suppose they are getting 20 years, 30 years. But Popa speaking, their Popa speaking, their diksha is not complete. Popa speaking, their diksha is not complete. And Popa himself speaking, their diksha is not complete, so they have no right to worship Vigraha. Popa speaking, I can show you. They are not, their diksha is not perfect diksha. So they have no right in archan. Then, what do you mean? Well, yes, Papa speaking. But what, what then? What is the meaning of that dikha? Well, they can get some sukriti. They can get some sukriti. You know, sukriti. You know, sukriti. Good luck. Bhakti sukriti can get. So why was thinking wrong way? So this way, all with full attention. I can promise you, if you can hear Harikatha with full attention, you can, you can, you can get a feeling of Samanda Gyan automatically, automatically, because I am speaking about Popat Bhakti Mithoku, no personal philosophy, this way. Now, I can come to the point, so Godadar Pandit this way, <coughs> Going to manifest Leela there in Nilachaldam. <coughs> in Nilachaldam, also doing this kind of Leela. In Nilachaldam, there Gauranga Mahaprabhu staying in, staying in Gambira. And Gauranga Mahaprabhu discover one deity from Aitota, from the sand covering, you know, in sea beach sand. There Aitota. One garden. From there, there is sand. From sand, Gauranga Mahaprabhu discover, discover one deity. It is called Tota Gopinath. Actually, Tota means it was found on Tota, Tota, Tota garden. That's why Tota Gopinath. Actually, he actually Gopinath. Tota, we say, to a nickname. Nickname. Nickname, you know, Tota Gopinath. And Gauranga Mahaprabhu going to give this service, seva, to Gadadhar. Gauranga Mahapu personally giving this eye, you know, it automatically coming out. Very nice. You know, in Puru Purushottam, you have seen, na? 
there. That seva was given to Godadar Pandit. Gorang Mahapu speaking, you can do this seva. Up to the last moment, up to the last moment of Gadadhar Pandit, Gadadhar Pandit was doing this seva. But there is some question. Gadadhar Pandit always expressing some positive mood. Positive mood means like Rukini. If Goranga Mapu become angry, <coughs> if Goranga Mapu become angry, eh, expressing angry lila, purposely, saying Gadadhar become frightened, fearful. So, one day Godadhar Pandit speaking to Guranga, I am not getting the power of mantra. By chance I speak to somebody this mantra, I cannot, I cannot remember because Diksha mantra, if you speak to somebody, you can lose your power. Diksha mantra, if you speak to somebody, you can lose your power. So, only Gurudev can do. <coughs> It is not, uh, you know, expressible. So this way, Godadhar Pandi speaking to Gorang Mahapu, I cannot get the power of that mantra. What happens? Maybe I have, you know, spoken this mantra to somebody. I cannot remember. So could you please speak this mantra again to me? Gorang Mahapu speaking, your Gurudev is, you know, Godadhar, your, to Godadhar Mahapu speaking, your Gurudev is already Pundarik Vidyanidhi. I indicate. I indicate your Gurudev is Pundarik Vidyanidhi. He can give you again this mantra if you are losing power. I cannot give. This is not the system. So you have to wait. Or oh, when he can come, he can come very shortly. He can very shortly, he can come to Purushottam Dham to meet with me. Then you can again take this mantra from him. But I cannot speak. I cannot break any rules and regulations. This is not the system. <coughs> so, Gadadhar Pandit was waiting for, for Pundarik Vindanij to, to come in the Dham and then again taking this mantra from, from Pundarik Vindanij. This way, when Ballav Acharya, you know, <coughs> when Ballav Acharya, Ballav Acharya, Going to meet with Gorang Mahapu, so many cases I don't like to speak, time cannot permit. Then Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu watching that due to high quality, due to high quality, Pandit, great Pandit, nice looking and from a high family and rich man, so automatically is and some popped up. Then false ego. So Gorang Mahapu giving punishment to him. I am not going to details. He is going to speak to Gorang Mahaprabhu that I have written one commentary of Bhagavatam. I cannot accept the commentary of Siddha Sahipad. This way speaking, audacity, expressing audacity, Gorang Mahapu giving punishment indirectly, indirect punishment, indirect punishment. <coughs> then he is writing Commit your Bhagavatam, he likes to recite in front of Mahapu. Mahapu say, I am not qualified, I cannot understand. I am not qualified to hear because I am Murka. Murka, you know, Murka. I am foolish, number one, Murka. <coughs> and also, you are not going to obey, you are not going to obey the commentator, and know, Siddha Sahipad, he is the original, you know, he is writing by the mercy of Nishingadev. He is writing commentary by the mercy of Nishingadev. Siddharam Vetti Nishinga Prasadat. By the mercy of Nishingadev, Nishingadev appeared and put hand on him. That's why all the meaning of Bhagavatam is totally clear in front of Siddha Sahiba. He has no false ego. Then you are not going to accept Samipad, then you are pros. You are prosmin, not that way. Mahapu not speaking that way. Mahapu speaking, Shami nahi mane tare besha Those who are gone, those who are not going to obey husband, they are actually pros. Mahapu speaking in direct way. Then he becomes shocked. <coughs> some other day, eh, some other day he is speaking, I have written the meaning of Harina, Harinam, Krishnanam, meaning. Mahapu say, I am actually Murkha. 
I don't understand the meaning. I only understand is Jasudanandan. I, I only understand Jasudanandan, Jasudanandan and uh, Nandanandan. This I know. I, I also less interested about other meaning. I cannot hear. Mahaprabhu ignore. Then where to go? When Mahaprabhu ignore, you know already, when Mahaprabhu ignore, then whole Vaishnav society becomes sick up, sick up, you know. So everybody, you know, Mahaprabhu ignore. I like to read this commentary to, no, 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 I have no right. Everybody. Advaita Gosai, oh, everybody. They are going to leave. They are not going to hear. Because Mahaprabhu ignore, nah, they know, they get information. They get information, so they naturally want to ignore. No, actually, I have no time, actually. I, I have no quality. So everybody is going to ignore him. So he is feeling insulted. He is a great, you know, he is feeling nah, great Acharya. So, Ballava Acharya. So he is feeling insulted. Someday approaching Godadar Pandit. Godadar Pandit was in great form because he is a very soft personality. Godadar Pandit is a very soft person. If somebody is speaking all rubbish, he can keep silence, cannot speak. It's very soft personality. So that Ballab Bhatta reaching and speaking, Godadar, I like to read this. <laughs> Godadar was in dilemma. What to do? Mahaprabhu ignored, but he cannot insult him. Are you here? Actually, I am going to, I already write the meaning. What to speak? If he is speaking, no, I cannot hear. It is insulting for him. If here, Goranga Mapo can give punishment, where to go? Dilemma. Then somehow, Gadadhar Pandit sitting silently and thinking the lotus feet of Gauranga. Prabhu, you know everything. I am not going to hear. He is forcefully reading. He is only saying, thinking the lotus feet of Gauranga. You know me that I am not going to hear. Don't give me punishment. And speaking Gaur Nam. He is speaking explanation, he is not hearing. Gaur, 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 speaking Gaur. After that, information going to Gauranga Mahapu. Gauranga Mahapu sitting inside. Gauranga Mahapu expressing angry Lila. Yes, you are going to hear the commentary of, you know, Harina Mahamant. Actually, I am not here. You hear? I know, you hear, and he started crying. Mahaprabhu can leave him, he started crying heavily. <laughs> Goranga Mahaprabhu speaking some with joking mood, speaking some heavy. Ah, he had that kind of adversity you are hearing, huh? I ignore him. Actually, I am not hearing him. Mahaprabhu speaking heavily, then Godadar blasted into tears heavily. Then Goranga Mahaprabhu started laughing. Goranga Mahaprabhu say, I was joking with you. I was testing you how much you love me. I was speaking in a negative way. You you taking it very seriously. I was speaking, you know, joking with you, but you are taking it very seriously. Actually, not that. I know everything. I know everything. Don't do that. Actually, this kind of Leela always going on. One day Nitananda Prabhu bring super fine rice. At present in the whole world, if you search this kind of rice, you can. Because Nithyananda Prabhu collected. <laughs> Balaram. Where from get you know? If the rice is there, the smell can go here and there. Like, you know, lotus honey. Everywhere. So nice. Uh, three kg something. Nithyananda Prabhu bring from Bengal and giving this, you know, packet to Gadadhar, Gadadhar, you can cook this rice today. We can take prasadam eh? together. Nice, na? God's been well, very good. Then Gadadhar going to collect some sp spinach, you know, in the garden, naturally. Now they are applying, you know, urea, this, that. But that time, naturally growing, all everywhere. All poor people, they have no money. They can go to, they can go to field and get boil and take. We heard from my, you know, mother, father, grandfather, they were very cheap market. Very cheap. You know, follow. <laughs> he, you can make a go down of rice with one rupees. You can make a go down. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> so cheap. 
that time, you know. That time, and Gauranga Mahaprabhu, you seek how long ago? I am speaking about father, grandfather. And that time, so cheap. So, what about that time when Gauranga Mahaprabhu was there? That time, Gadadhar collected all spinach and everything from, uh, from here and there, and very tasty offering to Gopinath. Offering to Gopinath <coughs> and offering was done, Aruti done, actually prasadam was taken outside, then Nityananda taking preparation to take prasadam, hungry. Gadadhar Pandit also going to serve. In the meantime, Gauranga, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna going here. <laughs> Gauranga speaking, what you are doing? Without me, you are taking prasadam? No, no, actually, no, I can also take the new... Now you take actually, we can write. No, you can make this prasadam in three part. We can cook again, Prabhu, you can take. No, this prasadam we can make three part. We can share this prasadam. I have also right, I have also my right to take prasadam of Gopinath, Godadhar, you. Yes, you have your right. Then this way, joking and joking. Then after that, they are taking prasadam nicely. This way, Gadadhar Pandit, sometime doing this kind of leela, different kind of leela, positive mood, you know, crying. <coughs> and when Gauranga Mahapu expressing, when Gauranga Mahapu finally expressing, Manjuri Baba, Radha Baba, very special, because this question can come. If you are very intelligent, you can put me question. Maharaj, at the time, at the time, at the time of that, you know, Gambhira Lila. You can put question, it's quite natural. Because at the time of Gambhira Lila, why Maharaj Godadhar is not there? You can put question, see, is Radharani, is Radharani? You can put this question. Why inside Gambhira Mandir, we can only find in Gombira inside, in Gombira inside, when Mahaprabhu getting the taste of, you know, Radha Baba, you know, Radha Baba, the Manjari Baba, I already explained the three different kind of Baba. Sometime expressing Manjari Baba, I already explained, you forget, you cannot remember. All Mahara, all Gauranga Mahaprabhu, what speaking, it is going to prove that is now Manjari Baba. Sometime expressing Radha Baba, eh? sometime expressing Shakhi Baba, Manjari Baba, this kind of Baba. But anyway, why we, why we cannot find Gadadhar Pandit inside Gombira? Whereas he is Radharani. He is Radharani, na? but we cannot find. We only find Lalita and Vishakha. Lalita is you know, our you know, Sarup Gosai and Vishakha is you know, Rai Ramananda. They are all, they are all the time going to, they are all, they are all the time they are going to, you know, give, you know, consolation to Mahaprabhu. Because Baba is not tolerable. Extreme limit, Goranga Mahaprabhu. That time, consolation given by Sarup Gosai, by Kirtan, and Harikatha actually speaking, our Harikatha actually speaking who? Our Raya Ramananda. Now, question can come, Godadhar point is why not there? Point is that the Baba already stolen. If Radharani is Baba, is actually there is so many con so many questions can be there. Because I already explained from Aprakita Jagat, in Aprakita Jagat, if one thing is taken from another thing, follow, I told, na, if something is taken from, something is taken out from a complete thing, then in the material world, it, 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 it becomes incomplete. But in Aprakita Jagat, not so. Purnasya Purnamadayo Purnameva Avasishwati. 
I can dis discuss in such a way that there is no possibility of misunderstanding. Follow? Somebody can put question. So Radharani Baba is stolen. What do you mean? If Radharani Baba is stolen, that's mean that's mean that Radha Baba is not there. This question can come. Answer is that. Answer is that. It is true. From a complete thing in eternal world, from a complete thing, if I take something, or if I take complete from from the from the complete, I'm taking the complete. Still the residue can be there. Like Govardhan like Giriraj Govardhan coming from Aprakita Jagat. Still Giriraj Maharaj is there. So how possible? So the answer is that answer is that it is question of Leela. It is the question of Leela Vilas. It is the question of Leela Vilas. It is not question of argument. It is the arrangement of Gauranga Mahaprabhu that the Baba is already stolen and Godadar coming now to do some compensating Leela with Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Eh? That's why Godadar Pandit now expressing no jig jag Leela. Radharani mood is jig jag, na? Jig jag mood, you know? Sometimes positive, sometimes negative. Oh, this kind of, you know, anurag, rag anurag. But Godadar is purposely by the desire of Krishna, I mean Gauranga, is purposely now having only positive mood, just like Rukini. Rukini, one day, Rukini, one day, you know, Rukini, one day, actually giving hand fan. Then Bhagavan Sri Krishna purposely making joking with Rukini. Rukini, you are so nice looking, actually so beautiful, and you are the daughter of you know king, and I am actually beggar. Actually, I am beggar. Krishna speaking, and the explanation given by Rukini, you can go mad. Someday I can discuss. Rukini speaking, really you are beggar, I know, really. Krishna speaking with joking mood. Actually, I am Niskinchan. And those who are Niskinchan, they actually worship me. Actually, you can again marry one prince, Rajkumar. I am actually beggar. Why you, why you marry me? I have nothing, no property. His kingdom is actually Ugrosen Raja. Actually, you are the daughter of one king. So you should, uh, I, you are allowed now. I allow you to marry a new, you know, King or you know prince, you can. <coughs> then Rukini thought, see, see, thinking that it is not joking, it is seriously. Then Rukini fall down on ground, unconscious, and the hand fan gone this way. <laughs> Krishna immediately catch and started giving water in the face and started hand fan, and somehow Rukini going to get the consciousness coming back. Then Krishna started laughing. I joke with you and you take it seriously. Eh? I joke with you and you are taking it seriously, you fall down on ground. Unconscious, totally fall down. This way, this kind of positive mood we can find with Gadara Pandit. <coughs> Another basis, so many things I like to speak, but time cannot permit. <coughs> Goranga Mapo took decision to go to Vrindavan. In the way of Vrindavan, first of all, Gauranga Mahapus is supposed to go to Bengal to take bath in Ganga and after that can go. But Godadar, Godadar like to follow Gauranga because like shadow, mentally, mentally shadow is staying, physically also. Mahapus can no, you cannot go. You cannot go with me. My, it is my, if you love me, I give you your worship, you know, Tota Gopinath. And you have also taken Khetra Sanyas. You have taken resolution that you can never go out of Sri Khetra. You can never go out of the area of Sri Khetra. You have taken resolution. How you can go with me? No, I can go with you. No, you can. No, you cannot go with me. No, I can go with you. No, I can. I cannot take you. Okay, you need not take. I can go separately, not with you. 
Gadadha, try to understand. Try to understand this point. I give you instruction to worship. I give the responsibility to you, the seva of Gopinath. Now, if you go away, then this aparad is coming to me. Because I give you instruction. You are supposed to do Gopinath seva, or you are not doing, you are going to follow me, then all the whole aparad can come. Then Godadha is saying, well, this aparad, you need not take this aparad. If I live, if I live, if I live the seva of, if I live the seva, of Gopinath, if I live the seva of Khetra Sanyas, it is my responsibility. For your lotus feet, for your lotus feet, I can, for your lotus feet, I am ready to, I am ready to cancel such countless seva. I am ready to cancel such countless seva for your lotus feet. I cannot allow, I cannot live without you. Then finally, Mahaprabhu cannot force. Gadadhar Pundit coming up to Kotok, you know, Kotok long distance is breaking Khetra Sanyas. My Khetra Sanyas all can go to hell. I like to see your lotus feet. Mahaprabhu cannot check. So up to, up to Kotok coming, after that, Mahaprabhu going to catch Gadadhar. Gadadhar, Gadadhar, try to obey me. Try to obey me. Don't go with me. It is my request. If you love me, you will have to follow my instruction. You are not sense enjoyer that you like to go with me. You have to obey my instruction. Then Gauranga Mahaprabhu finally, leaving Gadadhar, going to get the boat to cross the river and go, not taking Gadadhar. Then Gadadhar, like mad crying, and fall down on ground unconscious. Gauranga Mahapur not looking, because if Gauranga Mahapur looking, heart can break. So Gauranga Mahapur not looking, like mercilessly, like sannyasi, it okay, na? mercilessly, not looking. Then, running. Godadhar fell unconscious, then Gauranga Mahapur reached you know, <coughs> Bangla, took birth in Ganga, everything, and finally going to, fi finally going there in Ramkeli Gaon. You know Ramkeli Gaon? And the Rup Shonathan saying, Ramkeli Gaon. Finally going Ramkeli Gaon, meeting with Rup Shonathan. Mahaprabhu speaking, people asking, people asking, Prabhu is going, to, Prabhu is supposed to go to Bindavan. Why going to North Bengal? Ramkeli Gam, they don't know. Actually, I'm coming to meet you with you, Rup Sanatan. Finally, Mahaprabhu going to Kanan Natsala. From there, Mahaprabhu come back again. Mahaprabhu, cry, Mahaprabhu crying and speaking. Gadadhar, Gadadhar, I give pain to Gadadhar. I give pain, I give pain to Gadadhar. So this time I'm not successful to see Vrindavan. I give pain to Gadadhar. So I am not successful to see Vindavan Dham. Now Mahaprabhu again go back to Purushottam Dham. Godada laughing. This kind of Leela doing so much Tattva Vigyan I can speak. Tirobhaptiti also coming. That time I can discuss today not possible. So, Sangsara Sindhu Tarani Hidayam Yadi Sat Sankirtanam Ritara Se Ramate Manoschet Vemam budho viharane yodhi chitta bhiti Chaitanya chanda charane kurutanuragam Chaitanya chanda charane kurutanuragam Vanchakalpadurosike vasindu bhavach Patitanang pavanam bhavishnabhyo namo namo